guys welcome to today today is September 30th it's Aboriginal Awareness Day and we're gonna watch a YouTube link that I have that somebody gave me for um, the, in Ottawa I guess there's a truth and reconciliation um, going live on YouTube in Ottawa so we're gonna watch that but before we do that because it's still early morning, we're going to get hay. hay. We're gonna go get some hay, because we need hay, and I'm gonna get like two loads of hay today, just because I like to store some extra for winter time, and winter's coming, so we're gonna get that hay done early this morning, and it's early morning, around eight o'clock, 8.30. We're here, we're at my hay. This is my load of hay, and I got help this time, so Somebody can I'll put the hay in and somebody load it up for me. Somebody straighten it out onto the truck. I and I will hand it over and or maybe you hand it over. You know how I stand it up? Start on one end, maybe start on this end. Those are lighter. Maybe some are heavy, some are light. It depends how dense everything is. No, the other way, facing. Yeah, like that. All right. This is the first time I didn't get to do hay. I know, me too. You guys are getting bigger. This is your future, man. This is your future. That is why you um, have stable hands. I don't know yeah, yeah, but you gotta pay them. If you have money, but if you have no money, you gotta yeah, do this. Maybe. You have to do this yourself. Now you have to fit one more in there. They do this while you work. There we go. Two to go. <laughs> One more to go actually. I'll bring this home and I'll get the other load. That's our left load. Our other load. Luckily we live close enough. And he stores all my hay here for me. Um, so I have a set amount of hay here. So I have a number of hay here that is just for me, but that's a lot of hay. That'll be pretty gone soon because a lot of people buy hay, but he stores my hay separately. So, so I have my supply till till next spring. But I like to get like a extra, have some extra just in case. All right, it's afternoon, and next on the agenda, got the trailer hooked up. To the tractor, yeah, there's stuff at the end. Got the trailer hooked up to the tractor. We're gonna get all our jumps that are along the arena and we're gonna put them on the tractor and we're gonna store it for the winter. That's a terrible step. I know, it's a terrible step. There's a step. There's no handle really. But you know, normally what happened was, see how they extended this? Yeah. There would have been this on the end of that. That back would have been on the end so you wouldn't be able to hold on to it and use the step. That little step, but. There's nothing to hold on to. Anyways, we're going to get all that lawn furniture we're going to put in the barn and we're going to get all the jumps that are around the arena. Spring cleaning. Well, there's also on a farm, there's winter cleaning. You have to get everything ready for the winter. This is part of winter cleaning. Fall cleaning. Right. Fall cleaning. Got my two, two trusty workers. I put my cross in sport mode. And for some reason we realized today, as I went to go get coffee, that there was a lot of school buses going on. Today is like uh, Aboriginal Truth and Reconciliation Day. It's a federal holiday. So I thought everybody was off today. But it seems like it's just like a regular Remembrance Day here. Everybody's working, everybody's in school, and I guess they're doing something at school. So we did something at school. Watch the video and now we're gonna work. 
<laughs> so that's what we're doing. Work, 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 and then Gabby's got a test to write. All right, we got all our stuff stacked up. We don't have all the stuff in the arena in here, but we're gonna use that. Still, I got my extra load of hay. That's, with three horses, that is 12 days of hay. And that's my emergency ration, if I ever need some. Because there's a snowstorm, I can't get hay, or some reason I can't get hay, but that's my emergency. And that's my weekly ration of hay right there. That's actually two weeks worth of hay. But in the winter time, it, it'd be about one week of hay. Um, the horses don't go in the grass, so they eat more hay. So now we're gonna move our furniture into the barn and that's gonna be a lot more heavy lifting for that stuff. That's been empty for some time. Since she left us And somehow I'm soldiering on And now you walk into my life And ask me to love again Good uh, morning guys, welcome to the Adventures on the Day by Day farm Today uh, Sam and the girls have been working hard outside I've been working hard inside So we've been, Sophie has been searching through nature Um, we have a tree that has seeds Wait, I have a question it's really important. What happened to your lips? Well, I put lipstick on. Oh, okay. Go ahead. Why does everyone ask me that? Because <laughs> they look different. And a mushroom. That's a giant mushroom. Do you want to eat it? No, I definitely don't, but thank you. So, uh, Sam, I used this thing to bring all here. Just here, bring them up to the house. I'll wash them all. Here. I can. We're not walking all the way up to the house. I will wash them. And Basically, he brought all the patio furniture stuff. I gotta got wash free, everything. We got a free wagon ride. You got a free wagon ride out of it. Looked out of the window and I saw them coming down. Sam driving the tractor. Sophie's sitting on the back. Gabby, what were you driving something else or just pushing something? I was sitting beside her. Oh, she was sitting beside her. Well, anyway, I saw this big, huge, heavy load of stuff coming down from the back. If you didn't see her, it's because um, a thing fell off. Yeah, something fell off and I think she got it. That's exactly it. What are these called then? The chestnuts. Oh, okay. So uh, we just basically brought this in. I'm gonna have to wash all the covers for this and maybe I'll uh, wash it all up and prepare it for winter. If you guys know what this is called. Acorn. You have five seconds. Acorn. Five, Acorn. 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 two, one. Acorn. Hazelnut. Acorn. <laughs> She believes her dad before she believes me. Dad said it's a hazelnut. I say it's an acorn. She said it's a hazelnut. <laughs> She's dumb. I have, this is a hazelnut. Look, you crack, you crack it open. It's like an acorn. So two against two. You can't crack it open like that. Did and you get it? No, it's an acorn. It's just missing the little top. All right, let's bring the horses in. So uh, Sam, I've got more hay. He's trying to fill this area up with hay too. They brought all of our jumps and everything in, which is amazing. Like it, they've been working hard. I told you guys long ago that I never clean my house, like really clean it, like big clean. Um, and the summer, because summer is so fleeting and we just want to be outside and do stuff. We're a doing stuff family. Because of that, we want to do as much stuff in the summer as we can. So I straighten up, but I never like to deep clean. So that's what fall is for. My horse likes food better than friends. <laughs> Normally if I stand at the gate, Penny will come when her friends are gone. But more and more, she doesn't. <laughs> she doesn't. Now she's like, come and get me, I dare you. Come on. Come on. All right, little missy. 
I've been calling you and calling you. Why didn't you come? Why didn't you come? I know, Willow's been calling you. We all been calling you. And you don't even care. So apparently, if you carry a carrot in your hand, literally, your horse will walk perfectly. All right, we're gonna see if the noise. So if he's gonna play animal sounds, don't play. She's like, oh, I better leave. <laughs> They're all interested. Is that pigs or horses? It's a sound that I used. Mm. Get that one from YouTube where it's like animal sounds. So this is the week that I wanted to try at starting to like exercise Penny on a walk and, and walking her over poles and stuff to try and strengthen her and get her ready. But... She's in heat, so yeah, it's waiting till next week. We're waiting till next week because this girl does not want to ride her while she's in heat. Oh, hello, friendly. I know. You're a cute baby. These are bad ones. Let me do farm animals. Oh, that must have been a boy. Penny's like, I hear you. So she always tries to bite my ring. Don't bite my ring. Don't bite my ring. You guys know that Sophie really wants to ride Western, so she brought my saddle. A puffer belly, somebody found one. Take me home. All right, Mr. Mr. Magoo. All right, so I guess I didn't tell them. Our vet actually wants us to walk Chino up hills. Lots of walking up hills to strengthen certain areas of his body. I've been doing the best I can, but it's a pretty neat sunrise, a little brighter shade of blue. All right, so we're trying it, and I think it's, I think it, like, I don't think it's, well. Not as tight as the other one, that's for sure. So, if it's really good everywhere, it might... No, I feel it. I think it's good, Sophie. All right, we'll try it. The only thing is if it's too long, but I don't think it is too long. All right, we'll try it. Sophie's going western. I did not clean my saddle, though, because... We're only going to the end of the first field. That's as far as I'm going today. Gabby wants me to clean out the locker. Everybody's like, clean it out yourself. Are these all our bits or some of them Brandon's? Those are Tiana's. Oh. So what I'm saying is that our vet wants us to walk Chino a lot uphill. So that's what we're doing. We're out there, we're going to do our part. That's what happens with horses. You've got to do everything they need. Horses are more complicated, confusing, and more work than children. So we are ready. The western saddle seems like it fits them okay, but then we added the saddle pad and it makes it kind of sit up a bit more. But I'm going to be sitting on it, yeah. so it's going to be like down. So we're going to see. We're going to see if Finn likes it. Um, I'm going to get one in the arena. No, you can't. Somebody's having a lesson. I, I thought they were on the trail. Oh, are they? I heard. No. Oh, well. Anyways, let's get up. Let's go. Let's How do, do it. All right. I know, it, that's the weird part. You sit so far up off your horse. One thing about Finn is he doesn't like to, to, to wait. The thing is, is that I have anxiety too about trail rides. But more, I have anxiety about the fact that I'm in charge. Like, this is not my strength. So, it makes it harder for me. Get to me and make it though. That's what you gotta do, you gotta pretend like you're strong and brave. And there's two cups of coffee in my car and a detour in my way. You know it's too late to walk away. You crashed into my life like a category five, but is it too fast for a broken heart?
scared is because of trail riding is because trail riding is scary. It's worse than like riding in an arena. It's scarier than jumping. It's scarier than a lot of things because you're outside in the wide open. And if your horse gets scared, you can't control things that can happen that can scare your horse. And you have less control of where your horse goes because there's no fence saying stop now. So trail riding, ever, like uh, growing up, I was thought trail riding was like a slow, easy thing that horses did that was boring as heck. And you just walked in a line, but it's not like that at all. All right, so down there, and then over behind those trees is a huge hill. It's the only place that Gabby can really ride Chino on hills. And the vet wants him to do lots of walking up hills. It's only one hill. It's a big hill. So we're going to just work with what we have. Sophie's trotting. Look at that head, you guys. Look at that head. Finn's going back. Are you, are you coming with me? Yeah, I'm coming with you. I just want to make sure Gabby's okay. Can you squeeze? So do you like the saddle or no? It's a little too squeaky. There's two chipmunks chasing each other. I love chipmunks. They're over there. Oh, I love them. They're huge. There's one right there. She must be pregnant. There's one right there. Oh, I see it. They're adorable. I love chipmunks. Um, I trotted in the first field and the second field. You and, have a leaf on your head. And Gabby just walked? Yeah. Oh, good. It's like on the front. Yeah, you like it? You see your friend? He wants to go back because when I made him go back, he was like, Oh my god, oh my god, guys, oh my god, guys, we're going home. Yeah, because he's not used to it. He needs to get confident in it. Right, Vinny? Yeah. Baby's not going up the hill. Are you going up the hill? I feel torn in two, you guys. Like, Sophie needs me to go back with her. But I don't like to leave Gabby out in the woods with deer and turkeys and bunnies and chipmunks. Like, I don't like to leave her. But she needs to go up the hill and it's really far. Like, I, I couldn't walk there. going home he's taking off with her he's like let's go home look she can't even stop him there's a mare over in our horse's field that's their field where they eat and it's calling out to Finn oh it's a gelding oh I think it's a mare oh, I'm still looking for my Gabby don't you know that you're beautiful